Hello everybody, it's Barbara and welcome to Warrior Friday. A lot of intense energies going on this week. Oh my gosh, we had a really super bad storm here in Sox Center. We've got skies filled with not just smoke from fires. There's a lot of chemicals. I have chemical burns on my face just from being outside. Um, and I'm not an outside person lately because I don't like when it's super hot. So I know this is from outside and it's only on the exposed areas. So we had, um, we've had a lot going on this week. And if you, in our area anyway, have been experiencing issues with your throat, um, your mouth, your ears, any of your skin that's been exposed, not covered by clothing, this is why. It's, it's this chemically smoke stuff that has been hovering over our state, okay? Detox. I soaked my feet for two hours last night in apple cider vinegar, excuse me, raw organic apple cider vinegar and water, um, hot water. Drink that raw organic apple cider vinegar. Do whatever you have to to detox, but get this stuff out of your body, okay? Having said that, we have a card from the Earth Warriors deck, the fabulous Earth Warriors deck that we just love, and we get card number 36. This is Mayu, and it says Soma from the Galactic heart. <clears throat> so let's see what the book says about Mayu. The Divine Mother's milk of the galaxy is feeding your soul. Expansion of your horizons, your spiritual purpose, and your sacred responsibilities is taking place. I've had intense dreams this week. Um, dreams about the second sun, um, and that's S-U-N one in the sky there's a second one up there and I've seen videos of it and I've seen it in person so I know it exists there's storms all over the place this is to stir everything up because when the energy is stirred up the stuff that was at the bottom rises and this allows us to see what people really are we've all been wearing facades for thousands of years and now is the time for those facades to drop, those masks to drop. And people are showing their true colors. They're showing how evil they are, they're showing how nasty they are, and they're showing how good they are. And there's this definite split in all the people because there's those that are on the side of light and there's those that are on the side of dark. And there's a definite split. There is no middle ground anymore. You cannot sit on the fence. You're either for light or dark, one or the other. I highly recommend you be on the side of light because things are going to go much better for you. Just saying. Um, divine potential within you is awakening at a higher turn of the creative spiral of consciousness. This oracle is prophecy of ascension and grace ascension and grace your soul has been going through a deep spiritual feeding process and is growing rapidly it's like we're babies the evidence of this in the outer world will be a sense of expansion of opportunity reach connections and new levels of spiritual experiences if you are having visions if you are having dreams if you are having just messages giving given to you and you don't know where they're coming from First of all, ask, you know, hey, God, is this coming from you? Um, this is why the energy is so intense right now. The sun is sending solar storms and solar flares to our planet. It's raising the Schumann frequency off the charts, and it's actually downing the monitors. The monitors are very sensitive, and they can't even handle how high the frequency is. That should tell you something. Like right now, at this very moment while I'm filming this, I feel like my body is on fire. It's on fire because all of a sudden as I'm talking, I'm getting downloads, I'm getting upgrades, and it's amazing. You don't need to go to the doctor for this. The doctor's not gonna do anything other than try to give you some meds, which is gonna dumb you down. The days of being dumbed down are over. Wake up. This is your wake up call. Right now, right here today. If you're not awake, wake up. 
there are people who are not going to wake up and they're going to stay in the 3D world and your job is not to try to convert them into a higher level being because they're not going to be converted. Okay. There are some people that are just here for the 3D world and we have to just accept that and love them and let them go because they're not going where we're going. We are ascending. Not everybody is. This oracle foretells the welcoming in of a new phase in life. Newborn energies, remember I just said we're babies, newborn energies and fertility, whether biological, creative, or psychological, and I want to say spiritual as well, are being stimulated. This oracle indicates the discovery, development, and expression of talents. Some of the people that come in here are all of a sudden saying, gosh, I feel so creative. I'm going to learn how to weld. I'm going to learn how to create a new garden. I'm going to do all these cool things. I'm going to invent this. Um, an increasingly public profile, which moves you into the spotlight, can help you fulfill your divine life mission, provided that you keep your inner connection to spirit as the highest priority. This oracle speaks of soul healing around matters of trust, spirit, mother, and abundance. I just want to add this. It talked about keeping your connection to spirit as the highest priority. Yes, yes, and yes, because that should always be our number one priority. Our connection, our spiritual connection to God, creator, source, spirit, our higher selves, heavenly father, divine mother, Holy Spirit, this is what we need to focus our connection on because we can get protection from there and we all need protection. I keep getting hit by dark entities and I'm like, no, 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 just move along. Thank you, God, for guiding, guarding and protecting me. Thank you to all my spirit guides and guardians who live in the light for guiding, guarding and protecting me and my shop and my business. You're not going to get me. You're not. And I'm not saying that as a challenge. I'm just saying it as a fact. I refuse to even acknowledge that they're trying. It's like if some, if some bully comes along and tries to get you, you get a choice. You can give them your power. You can give them your energy or you can go, you got nothing. Move along. I'm not even going to give you the time of day. That's how we need to be. But now having said that, when somebody contacts you, like I had somebody contact me this morning and they say, help, this is what's going on. There's a dark entity. Our job is to say, no problem. I'm on it because you know what? The more of us that fight against those dark entities, the faster they go away. So if somebody asks you for help, even if you don't know what to do, you just say a prayer to God. That's all you got to do. It's not rocket science. It's easy. I really feel like a warrior today. I've been attacked so much this week with all these intense energies and I'm on top. That which does not kill us makes us stronger. So light warriors, remember you are 16 feet tall. You are a warrior for the light, for the light. You're a warrior. We are warriors and we are a whole huge unit. We are not here by ourselves. The 3D part of you thinks that, but the rest of you is like, I'm part of a big team and we got this and I have goosebumps. I don't know if you can see those, but I have goosebumps all over as I'm talking. So I know this is all true and I know we're supposed to be warriors. Now, if it makes you feel better, surround yourself with crystals, high frequency crystals, especially today. There's so much dark energy going on and we need these high frequency crystals. These are going to be the meteorites. These are going to be the, the, the clear quartz, anything in the quartz family. These are going to be, um, appetite, amethyst, um, 
bismuth, any of those high frequency crystals, you surround yourself with those and you know that you are a 16 foot tall warrior and nothing's going to take you down. You got this. We're a team. That is the message for today. I love you guys. And I send you blessings of love, light, peace, joy, happiness, success, divine health, and all good things because you are worthy and you deserve them all. Mwah.